Good morning toy fans, it is my birthday, welcome back to the channel Guys, today I'm off to Nerd Base We'll have a little rummage through their toys and see what greatness they've got Guys, come with me right now Here we are guys Back at the Nerds Happy birthday Johnny <laughs> So guys, as you can see, Craig's Nerd Base, he has such a fantastic range of Star Wars stuff. He's got retro, he's got new stuff, he's got everything guys. Action Fleet, he's got everything. Micro Machines, it's all in there guys. You need to get down to Nerd Base to experience this great shop. So guys, I'm going to show you, I picked up a couple of Star Wars bits at my, for my birthday. And it's none other. I picked up the Obi-Wan Kenobi. Inquisitors, so I've got this guy here. It's the fifth brother Absolutely awesome. I just love the way they've made them so much like the original retro figures um, I, I, I was thinking about getting these in the What I called the, the bigger figures. Oh, well, my mind's gone blank now but I've opted to get him in this size just for space and just for that old school feeling, you know. It's um, but these are great figures. So that's the fifth brother. I've also picked up the General Inquisitor. It's another great figure. You know, guys, imagine going back. Imagine going back to the eighties when I was there. And imagine having these figures as well, having Darth Vader standing there and having all these guys standing around him with their sabers and all that. It'll look absolutely awesome, wouldn't it? Look at them. And also, I picked up this guy, this lady, sorry, my mistake, ladies, I apologise. Um, Reva, and this, this, this character had mixed reviews. I thought she was awesome. It's good to have a... Badass Inquisitor who really didn't like following the rules. So they're the three Star Wars figures I picked up from Nerd Base. So let's see what else I picked up. Look at the artwork on that, that's immense. 
different. Hey, super shredder, I've got him. What in that, like that? Yeah, I've got super shredder. If you've got something like that, you just want to find it to put it in this box. <laughs> just in case. <laughs> That's a cool one. Drek.
choose from.
So guys, again, that was more of Craig's shop. I didn't do a full, full video today, but I've done enough just to capture the magic. It's definitely, in my opinion, it's got the best shop in the UK. No offense to Joan Gav, I love their shop in Leicester. But Craig's shop has got, it's just so much bigger and so much more range, uh, range wise. I haven't got down to the vintage toy monster in Portsmouth yet, but I can't wait for that. So let's wait for that one to come. So guys, the other things I picked up, now the only thing I ever picked up for myself was Craig had all the new Gremlins 2 batch and I had to get this guy. Look at him. And there's the, the back end of the card. There's all the new guys out. Absolutely awesome. Unsure if I'm going to open this or not, if I'm just going to stick it on the wall with the others. Uh, but absolutely awesome figure. I can't, I've, I've been looking, at, I was looking at these at the NEC um, and I didn't pick none up, and Craig had them, so I snapped this guy up. Now, once again, my beautiful wife picked, said pick one for Christmas, and I did. And I picked the <laughs> I had a wind up where I said, I'm going to pick the one that reminds me of you. And it was none other than Daffy. Absolutely awesome. Look at that figure. He's wonky eyes and all that. Now don't get me wrong, my wife hasn't got wonky eyes. She's actually, she's lovely. But just because she's a bit of a donut sometimes, I've opted for this one. So that's another Christmas present for me. So there are my two new Gremlins. One's for now, one's for Christmas, but I'm happy as fucking Larry, mate. Absolutely. Now, guys, I've been after something for quite a while, and I've, I've seen it at a few toy shows, and I remember seeing it once at um, Sandown for £60, and I did go back for it, guys, but it was gone, and I was like, guys, I was so gutted, honestly. Um, but Craig had it there yesterday, and I... While Debbie was picking me up a surprise present, I don't know what that is. Um, I went back round and it was in the horror section and it was there, guys. I looked up and I was like, oh my God, your clothes got it. So I pulled it down. Now, I did originally thought it was £70, which I thought was an absolute bargain. Um, it works out it was 78 Once again, I should have took my glasses. But £78, still a really good price for it. And it's none other, guys, than Chucky. Look at this guy here. Look at the scars on his face. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, <laughs> I've been like this for so long. It was having an irony because my youngest son Callum was um, as, as scared of this. But he seems to be coming around a bit now. He's 13, so, you know. But this actually does talk, guys. I don't know how. Never goes out of style. 
So I don't know exactly how many phases it's got, but it works. Um, a few of the issues with this figure is when I was trying to buy it off a couple of people, they turned around and said, oh yeah, it's, it's, um, the voice box doesn't work. This one does work. This is awesome. Um, so thank you very much, Craig from Nerdbase, for finally fulfilling one of my dreams to have this size Chucky in my collection. Um, I'm over the moon, guys. It's absolutely great. So guys, I've had a really good birthday. Um, we're going out tonight. I believe we're going to a show. Um, we're off to the pictures now to go and watch Pray for the Devil. Is it Pray for the Devil? So I'm really, really excited, guys. So I'm going to enjoy the rest of my day. I hope you've enjoyed my little nerd-based video. Guys, please hit that subscribe button. It doesn't cost you anything. It just helps my channel. I'm slowly getting there. Thank you for everyone that's been loyal. It really does mean a lot. Guys, have a great day. This is Vader Trons Toy Chest. Keep smiling, guys, and keep that toy lightning going up. Oh, yes.